the Tom Show. Hello. We have um, we have comedian Dwight Slade in the interview loft. Uh, he's sitting next to Christy Lee at the Bob and Tom News Desk. Across the way at the Bob and Tom Sports Desk, wearing a very nice hat. It's uh, it's uh, it's Chick McGee. I just found this. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna uh, have a chance to uh, chat with the uh, daughter of a good friend of the show. He is uh, Peter Frampton. We talked with Peter on his birthday last Friday, and now we're uh, joined by his daughter Mia uh, Rose on the phone. I think. Mia. Yeah, I'm here. Hi, how are you? I'm good. How are you? Great, thank you. Uh, did your father warn you at all about uh, this program? No, he just said that you guys are really nice. Okay, so good. I'm just huh? going to take his word for it. Oh, okay, <laughs> well, that's fine. We're we're big fans of, of your dad. And, oh, good. Uh, he's a wonderful artist, and uh, I know that uh, you're pretty excited about your new project, which he mentioned to us um, the other day. So that's why we yeah. wanted to, when we wanted to talk to you. Um, mm-hmm. You uh, are going to be in a movie called That's What I Am. Yes, I am. It's an amazing film. Yeah, tell, tell us about the movie and uh, what's the story on it. Well, it's basically a movie about tolerance and acceptance, and it deals with the topic of bullying. And it, uh, it's about the director's life, uh, a week in his teenage life in the 60s. Oh. Yep. Well, the, no. uh, so the director, it's actually uh, his story. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's, it's based off of his story. And you are the... Um Bully? Are you the bully? No, I'm definitely not the bully. <laughs> okay, Bob. Look at her. Well, look, I gotta ask. She look didn't at, say anything. She's a look young at girl, she's not a bully. You never know. You look at her picture. <laughs> she's so sweet looking. Yeah. Oh, thank you. I'm no. I play the love interest. Um, I play the you know that type of girl that all the girls want to be friends with and all the guys want to date. Mm-hmm. Oh. And I basically just teach him how to be around a girl. He's never really liked a girl before, and I'm his first full crush. Oh, wow. ah, okay. There now, and, and can, Mia, can I ask how old you are? I'm 15. 15? Oh, I have a 15-year-old. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. We no. can be a handful. Oh, mm-hmm. pff, dear God. <laughs> that is an understatement. Thank you very much, Mia. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> At least she admits it. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Now, uh, Mia, are, have you, um, ever, I'm sure, obviously, you've seen your, your father in concert many times. Yes, I have, many times. And I'm sure that you're fully aware of the legendary status of your dad as a musician. Yes, I am. And it, all I, I mean, he's still my dad, but when I see him, see him on stage, it just makes me really proud that he gets to do what he wants to do every single day. That's yeah, very yeah. lucky. Now, I, I, I hate to ask you this, but I really cannot help myself. Okay. okay. Have you ever walked up to him and said, do you feel like I do? <laughs> no, I haven't. No, you haven't? No, I haven't. Well, that's a, be a nice or, little way to, to greet him the next now, time. Uh, no, I'm not sure. Uh, the te- that's, that's how I'll greet him. Instead of saying, uh, I'm glad to see you, I'll say, do you feel like I do? Exactly. <laughs> now, there's something I'm sure you're aware of called the Framtone. Yes, we- I am. I've... She's talking through it right now. Yeah. <laughs> the, which, is, which is the electronic box gizmo thing that... Uh, yeah. Peter Frampton famously uses uh, on 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 uh, on stage, mm-hmm. and he and he, I must say he uses it in a very tasteful manner, never overdoes it. But uh, right. it's the device in which you um you can make that wacky, kooky talking guitar thing. Yeah, exactly. It's really cool. I like it. Yeah. Now, do you play guitar? I do. I've I've been playing for about three and a half years now. Who taught you? Uh, my dad taught me my first song, mm-hmm. <laughs> and then uh, he's like, I can't teach you everything, so he, he got me a guitar teacher. Oh, good. Now, was it, was it like a Beatles song, or some, or was yes, it one of... it was. Good one. Uh, it was, it was Blackbird. Oh, great song. Oh, that's a, that's a tough one to get started on. Yeah, I know. I just, you know, hit the ground running. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, cool. Well, cool. Uh, we're, we're talking with Mia Rose Frampton, and she happens to be the daughter of Peter Frampton, who is a good friend of this show. We were talking to Peter about the fact that... Aren't you, uh... In another movie called Bridesmaids? Yes, I am. It's a Judd Apatow film, and yeah. it's also directed by Paul Feig. And I'm an amazing scene, and, and an amazing scene with, scene with uh, Kirsten Wiig. Yeah. Who you probably know her from SNL. Oh, sure. I think oh, she's yeah. the best woman they've ever had in that yeah, show. Yeah, great. Yeah, it was, it, she's the funniest person you'll ever meet. She's, I just couldn't stop laughing. I had to, you know, be serious and, like, try to get the scene through, but I just kept laughing. She's the funniest woman i've ever met so how many uh how many takes oh god i don't even want to think about that that's probably probably 10 but i think like five of those were her laughing oh okay. i swear all right i promise mm-hmm. <laughs> oh. 
Well, now, Mia, are you, I know that you've uh, grown up in a couple different places, including uh, Cincinnati, Ohio. Are you going to be a Los Angelino now most of the time since you're making these movies and stuff? Yeah, definitely. I'm I'm just I'm staying out here. I'm at school here, and I'm just doing the acting thing out here in L.A. Okay. Are you going to regular school or home school? No, I go to regular school, actually. Well, that's cool. Regu- yeah. Regular high school, yeah. It's in regular yeah. California. <laughs> <laughs> What is like a regular kid? <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. uh, what is the name of the mascot for your school? The Warriors, regular Warriors. Actually, it's the Vikings. We're the Vikings. Oh, <laughs> oh really? Okay. Because yeah. when you think of Los Angeles, you think, <laughs> you think of the Vikings. Vikings. Oh, sure. Uh, Hi, he do. Uh, <laughs> What's your favorite subject? Hmm, I, I, it's either English or history, probably. Oh, oh okay. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Are you an actual gymnast? Nope, not at all. She's on a show, Make It or Break It, that my girls yeah. absolutely adore. They love it. Oh, does oh, she really? uh, flip around and stuff? Well, um, I learned a few things, but uh, I've been a dancer for a while, so you know that came in handy. Yeah, yeah. That's, mm-hmm. they go hand in hand. Mm-hmm. Well, Mia, I know you're doing great with your career. We're big fans of we're big fans of your dad too, and it's at some point I'm predicting in the future, um, instead of you being called Peter Frampton's daughter, they're going to switch everything around. And, oh, that guy! Yeah, yeah. That's that's Mia Frampton's dad. That's mm-hmm. what I'm hoping. <laughs> mm-hmm. uh-huh. Well, thanks. Hey, thanks, Mia. And once again, the film is called uh, "That's What I Am," and uh, one of the uh, uh, actors in the film is uh, is Mia Rose Frampton, the daughter it, of Peter Frampton. Are they? Uh, are, is, uh, are the two movies coming out at the same time, like the with bride ma- bridesmaids? Bridesmaids. As well? Bridesmaids is coming ar- out around May, but uh, that's what I am is coming out uh, this Friday. Oh, okay. Oh, well, great. All right. Okay, so that's yeah. the one we can check out this week. Okay, thanks very well, thanks much, Mia. Mia. Better get to school. So yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Have a great day at school. <laughs>